Hey guys, here are my rainbow TBR picks for July. For those of you who don't know about the rainbow TBR challenge that I'm doing, I will leave a link to the original video down in the description box below and you'll find the link up there as well. But you're basically just picking six different books based on the six main colors of the rainbow. One red, one orange, one yellow, one green, one blue, one purple. You can read anything you want, any format, as long as it's 150 pages or more. So for my red book I've chosen Catching Fire by Suzanne Collins and I actually just finished The Hunger Games a few days ago and I loved it so I'm happy to be finishing the rest of the series. I have seen The Hunger Games movies and I really enjoyed them but I know a lot of people said that the books are better than the movies so now I get to see for myself. For my orange book I've chosen The Star Church Queen by Roshani Chokshi and you can see the beautiful orange and pink sunset. When the sun sets, that's seriously my favorite time of day. It's so beautiful. I love sunsets. For my yellow book, I'm going to be reading The Hobbit by J.R.R. Tolkien, and my mom actually read most of the book to my siblings and I a long time ago, like years ago, and uh, she never finished, so I'm happy to finally be finishing the book. I was actually really enjoying what she did read to us. It was really good, and I love the movie, so I know I'm going to love the book even more, if not just as much. And for my book of green, I have chosen Please Look After Mom by Kyung Suk Shin because I figured I might as well throw a contemporary in there somewhere. I actually have a lot of contemporaries on my shelf and I don't read contemporaries very often. I try to, but I'm always pulled more towards the fantasy books first and so the contemporaries are just sitting there. I am doing my best to read all the contemporaries on my shelf but it's a very slow process, so eventually I'll have them all read at some point. And for my blue book, I've chosen A Northern Light by Jennifer Donnelly, which is a historical fiction, and no TBR pile is complete without at least one historical fiction novel, so yeah, I'm reading this one. And for my purple book, I have chosen Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone by J.K. Rowling, because there is purple in the cover. It was actually originally going to be my red book, but then I had a hard time finding a purple book. Well, not the... I don't have a decent amount of purple books on my shelf because I do. You can actually see some behind me, but I just, I don't know, I didn't really want to choose any of the other books on my shelf at the moment. So yeah, I'm going with this one. And it's about time that I read the Harry Potter series anyway because, I don't know, it's just everybody talks about Harry Potter and everybody talks about how great it is and I feel so bad that I've never read the books before. So I'm going to be reading it this month. And I know I'm going to enjoy it because I love the movies, so... Yep, I'm finally going to be reading Harry Potter. So yeah, these are the six books I'm going to be reading. Well, minus The Hobbit because I'm going to be listening to the audiobook format. What are you guys going to be reading this month? If you guys are going to be participating in the Rainbow TBR Challenge, then please let me know. Um, I would love to know what you guys are reading. You can let me know in the comment section below. Or if you have Twitter, you can tweet me a picture of your books. My... Twitter info is down in the description box below, so let me know if you guys are going to be joining me. If you like this video, then please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you guys next time.